Hi guys, from last couple of videos I am working on a tutorial series of how to create reports in SQL Server reporting services. In my last video uh, you saw how I created a tabular report and I explained you uh, about a few settings or options of tabular reports that's uh, page and uh, group and uh, details options of tabular reports okay in my, in this video i will show you the page option of tabular reports see uh, in some scenarios you might be uh, asked to create a report where you want to display category name at the uh, at the top of the page and and the products which comes under the categories that particular category you have to list down below okay. here you can see all the products which are belongs to this category are displaying here and the category uh, which holds these products are displaying at the top if I click uh, go to next page you will see I will get different category and the and these are the products under this category if I go further in, in, into the next page, I will see another category, and these are the products um, under this category. Okay, how to create this uh, um, report now? Okay, the uh, process is simple, guys. Let me show you how to create this. Now you need to go to your report first and click on reports, right click on reports, click add new report, just right here products by category okay now click on add next here i am using my shared uh, connection i have explained you about this shared connection what is shared connection and how to create a shared connection in sql server i have explained in my last videos please go and refer uh, the, that video guys uh, click on next click on query builder just increase the size of the window so that our tables are display properly and uh, select uh, some of the tables select category customers i want to display my records based on category so that's why i have created i have selected categories then customers order details orders products okay, now let us first refresh this okay customers details orders products and click on add close this and then click on category name select the fields between name quantity unit price order id or not order id order date and then product name okay now click on ok and then go next here i have selected tabular uh, report go here come here see these are the options which comes under tabulars tabular report now uh, as I shown you just a few minutes back that I want to display my products based on the category I want to display category name at the top of my page so select on category name and this page okay by doing this you will uh, get your category name at the top of your uh, page report and uh, your products name uh, will display in your details and then select detail and rest of the product uh, rest of the items or data fields will come in details okay now i have uh, added category name into my page and um, rest of the data that's uh, other columns in details so click on next next time um, ocean okay let's select ocean then click next and finish okay now let us okay. just increase the size okay increase the size of the report and now save it control s command preview see okay 
the size has not been increased okay here come and preview your page see reports is displaying and beverages you can see on the category name is displaying at the top and the products comes under this category are displaying here in the report and if i click on next you will get another category and if i click next you will get another category okay uh, if i want to um, format this now select select this category name make it as bold and go to the uh, foreground color and select the color okay and align it to center now let's view our report you can see now our uh, category name is displaying in the middle at the top okay so that's how you have um, you can create a report like this where you are displaying your categories uh, displaying your products name based on the category okay I hope you, you like this video if you enjoy this video subscribe to my channel and in my next video I will explain you about uh, this go about groups group option which comes under tabular reports okay thanks for watching guys